So far, what do you think of the course of Highlands? Yes, yeah, so it's beautiful. It it's beautiful. Um, and I'm actually here with T Mac with the Travel Media Association. Am I supposed to look at you or the thing? Just look at me. <laughs> I'm not used to getting interviewed. I'm not a YouTube guy like the happy camper. No, this is beautiful. I love this country. I mean, I'm from Muskoka, which is nice too, but this, uh, I love this rugged, rugged wilderness, the, uh, you know, the lakes. Uh, um, yeah, I love canoeing, love dipping a paddle. And so that's why we're here and we'll get some good stories out of it. With you guys, we're getting lots of good stories. <laughs> Oh, wait a minute. Is the superintendent of the park uh, looking at his... Looking uh, at my Blackberry. Yeah, you caught me. <laughs> Clear an email. It's a work thing. It's oh, a work thing. We're, we'll, we'll forgive him. We're forgiving. <laughs> what, what are you getting out of your job? So why, what's it? Because you worked in Algonquin. Compared to Algonquin to Quarthus, Algonquin probably has a little bit more to your heart. Or does it? Uh, it does, but I mean, I guess, no, the, I, I would say that I've enjoyed working in central Ontario. For the whole time so Alg yeah algonquin's a big flagship but Kawartha is just is beautiful right like i mean as many of the routes in algonquin what's your favorite part of the day to, to go out and my favorite part of working with the crews is because there's students and every year students come along and they change and they're all young and they're excited about their job and that is about the best thing what's your favorite part of the park I like Shark Lake. I really like Shark Why? Lake. Because I went to Shark Lake when I was 19 years old or 20 years old, and it was my first introduction to Kawartha at that time. And it's a, it was a completely different landscape because of the rock barrens. So seeing the rock barrens back then, it was like, wow, this is, it was like one of those times when you go to a lake and it's like, wow, this is different. It was a different spot, right? So. I mean, this is a beautiful lake. It's got pine trees and all of that, but shark is much more barren looking, right? It's so shark isn't Algonquin? Shark, shark is not Algonquin, no. Yeah. no. So instead of looking for the past of being in a place like Algonquin, you actually base it like that because it's different, right? Because it's different, yeah. yeah, for sure. What's going on? We're having asparagus tonight. <laughs> We're talking about asparagus and how it, it affects uh, affects the way that your urine. And you did not know this. I didn't know this. No, but I, I'm not the only one. Jamie wasn't, I've never wasn't in that camp. Either. How old are you, people? And you've never noticed that your urine <laughs> smells weird after asparagus. Uh, yeah, and I, I eat it. Over and I smell it when it's coming out. I don't know. Uh, we're asking you about <laughs> asparagus. What, what's going on? Well, uh, when you eat asparagus, it goes through your system, of course, and it changes the smell of your urine. I'd say it smells green. Now look at this. This is what we're having. For we got a little bit of beef, so we're gonna have some steak tonight. And this is this is great. Yeah. This is triple A grade. This is this is nice beef. Wow. Uh, it thawed during the path during the paddle today, and now we're uh, about to throw it on the grill. I think we got some three sisters stew tonight as well. Seriously? Yeah, we got three sisters stew, but actually it's more like quintuplets because I threw in some some potatoes in there as well. And uh, two kinds of beans, two or three kinds of beans. So yeah, we learned a lot of interesting things today. <laughs> About fashion, frying pans, a lot of things. <laughs> but the one thing I'm learning now is that uh, the way that asparagus affects your urine, apparently, and makes it, does it smell bad or good? I forget. It, smell <laughs> it just smells bad. Smell. I thought always, yeah. always urine smells bad, but I guess it makes it smell worse. Yours doesn't. I can't say that I've, I've noticed you know, I, I, I can't say that I've really stuck my nose right down there to see. You believe you have an enzyme in your body that, that takes this away? Uh, I have an enzyme in my body that takes a lot of things away, including the stinky urine, apparently. But in the name of research, I'm going to go and <laughs> have a I'll smell it now and I'll smell it after. and I'll, Then you can interview me and I'll let you know. Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. i got to get that video. What? What happened to the frying pan? Uh, yeah, still works for asparagus, right? We're not going to lose one, I hope.